Hey you guys, it is Aurora McHale and I wanted to bring you guys some really fun content. This is my rendition of the 10 styles challenge. <laughs> the first one being mine that you're seeing right now. This is a sped up uh, time lapse from Procreate. This would be my kind of cartoon style, um, which you will see that I changed two times after that. I did not like it. So next up, we've got the style of the Fairly Odd Parents, one of my favorite childhood shows growing up. So in order to do this, I wanted to find a character with curly hair. Um, the only thing close to it was Wanda. <laughs> so I exaggerated her one top curl and gave her like, two or three more um, to kind of more represent myself. It's very fun. I love this one a lot. And next, my favorite of the bunch, Bob's Burgers. So it'll be me as Linda with curly hair in that style. Alright, next, I have myself as Libby from Jimmy Neutron. I love this character, um, but you'll see, um, for me, what was important about me doing this challenge um, was representation and me being able to see myself as a young black girl who happened to be fair-skinned being represented um, in the styles of cartoon shows that I liked. I have never seen a black character look like me in a live TV show or a cartoon alike. So this was really important to me because I used to wear my hair like that all the time. I'm just not chocolate. I, I didn't get it. <laughs> I didn't get a couple things, but it's okay. Learn self love along the way. But this cartoon made me happy. This one definitely took the longest. Because I think it, well not, I think it was the only one that was remotely realistic or three dimensional. So obviously that would take more time. Oh, number four. Okay. <laughs> now, okay. I hope I'm not wrong, but I'm pretty sure this is number four. Again, with the representation piece, I just wanted to see my little light skinned black self 
you know, as some of my favorite cartoon characters, one being uh, number four from Codename Kids Next Door. I used to watch most, if not all of these shows, actually, well, except a few of them at my grandmother's house or my house growing up. Yes. And next, a show that I didn't watch quite as much, but I love the animation style. I love the the voice acting. It's such a fun show. If you can't tell already, it's Princess Bubblegum from Adventure Time. Yeah. Fade the boy. So, don't kill me in the comments, but I can't remember this character's name. She is from a show that I do appreciate called Daria, okay? The sarcasm is my life. <laughs> the apathy as well. <laughs> it's really bad. Okay, one of my all-time favorite shows, The Boondocks, alright? This is Jasmine from The Boondocks very naive character what i love about this animation style or this show is the use of the uh manga kind of animation style um is that is that manga um anime <laughs> anime manga i'm kind of not really in that culture so don't kill me um, but I love the fact that that animation style was used in this show. It's very <laughs> black, satirical, uh, uh, social commentary type show. It's hilarious. I freaking loved it. Can't nobody tell me otherwise. Here is the second time I tried to change my my little block for my own cartoon style. This was before I had my own cartoon style, okay? This took me a few months to finish in between school and other projects. I absolutely hated that, I'll have you know. <laughs> As you'll see, it's completely different than the final rendition in my thumbnail and at the end of the video I was trying to do my more realistic um, digital painting style didn't like it I didn't really like the selfie that I chose but I stuffed it anyway even at the end tried to add another background that didn't really do much for me but hey it's okay you live and learn why that's taking so long to move on. Come on, time lapse. Alright, okay. <laughs> Completely x that, as you'll see. This is one of my favorite movies of all time. This is DreamWorks, The Prince of Egypt, based off of the Exodus story in the Bible. It doesn't matter if you believe in the Bible and God or not. This is a beautiful movie, period, period, period. Um, this is myself as Miriam. I love her. She was such a beautiful character, beautiful person. Okay, and lastly, <laughs> one of my favorite illustrators his name is um john cornella um he makes these character styles and these uh 
these uh, illustrations with the best, most terrible humor. <laughs> and lastly, 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 I finally figured out how I would draw myself. And this style was developed after a series of illustrations that I've been doing for a contract that I've been so blessed to get um, with a local county for a mental health campaign. I discovered this style through uh, experimentation <laughs> and I quite like it. I don't know if I'll always be. Um, doing this style but I like it for now for the more fun things that I do digitally and that is all 10 we're done people thank you guys for tuning in and watching I hope you would stick around and Subscribe if you want to, leave a like, a comment if you want to, um, yeah, see y'all next time, bye.